this is, first of all, Council General Ho from Korea, who has come to be with us today. And I uh, think uh, most of the members of the press know Master H. U. Lee, who is the president of the American Taekwondo Association and a citizen of our state now. This year, the American Grand Nationals are being held in Little Rock over Memorial Day weekend, the 28th and 29th. There will be over 10,000 participants, including 3,000 competitors, expected to attend. Some of them are in this room, as you can see there, from all ages. Competitors from throughout the United States will join other Taekwondo students from Canada, Mexico, Paraguay, Guadalajara Islands, and Guam for the international sport. Competition has been formed for all ages and ranks and both sexes to create the largest one-style martial arts event in history. During this tournament, the American Taekwondo Association and Songam Federation National Tournament rules will be used by a special committee to monitor the consistency of competition. Over 30 rings of Taekwondo judging are operated continually with a two-day event with black belt events on Saturday and on Sunday the color belt competition to be held. The tournament will close with a victory dinner of Korean and American foods. The American Taekwondo Association spends over $100,000 to sponsor this competition each year. Master Lee considers this tournament the premier event of the year for Taekwondo competitors on the tournament circuit. It was started in 1976 as a single closed national tournament and has grown now into the event that it is over two days attracting thousands of participants. Because it's so important, that's why we're doing this and why I'm about to make a fool of myself. <laughs> Okay, uh, tell us what you're going to do. Yeah, I'd like to give you a uh, one minute uh, Taekwondo crash course. <laughs> Right here, like this. Right here. 